Hello, my best sound friends. Welcome back to more of the Demonic Manor series. This time I'm playing Demonic Manor 2, the sequel to the first one. And uh, I want to show you guys before I um, start the video. This is my new vape pen. This sucker is huge. So it's, it's called a Stick Prince. So it's actually really good. Like so, <coughs> it's really good. So, uh, let's do the Demonic Manor 2. Why waste time? Famous paranormal occurrence occurrence researcher, YouTuber er Eric Hahn hit the road in midnight to investigate the so-called haunted female dormitory. Rumor has it some female students joined a summoning ritual and worked on an evil being's infestation. The director of the dorm is lost for two years. From now on, it is Archon's job to solve the mystery. So here we go. I'm using a different screen recorder, so hopefully the screen recorder is better. Since D Recorder doesn't exist on Google Play Store anymore, so hopefully this screen recorder is better. So see my fast movements. Ah, hopefully. Oh, we're right into it. So here we go. Ooh, this is running smoothly. Daddy likes. All right. Cool. Key needs a door. God damn it. Uh, all right. Well, I guess we're going this way. Creepy as is, huh? All right. And I open that door. Hello, friends. Hello, everybody. Bookshelf felled. Well, fell. Sorry, not felled. What the hell am I saying? Seinfeld. What the hell is that picture? That's something out of Necronomicon. I did a, actually a playthrough of it, um, I think a couple years ago, a year ago. It's without commentary. So, check that out on my channel. If you're interested. Oh my god, there's nothing in here. Jesus. At least the screen recorder is pretty good, so... Hopefully. It's working just fine. Ooh. The beds move. Okay then. Oh, let me move it down a little bit, my camera. All right, I have studied much today. I am still affected by the dream I saw yesterday. I don't know whether it's a dream or not. Though someone has watching, was watching me right in front of the, right in front of the door. I couldn't recognize who it is, who it was, because it was dark. Yet I'm sure that is that was not a human being. Because I couldn't pray, my tongue was literally tied. Then I woke up sweating. I didn't want to talk to girls about it. I don't want to scare anyone unnecessarily. Good to know. So now, we can investigate more. But what's this? It's a box. With a key! Let's take it. Pick key picked up. Ooh. At least the screen recorder is running smoothly. I love it. I really love this. Runs definitely smoothly than my other recorder. So that way I can enter this door here. Okay. We're in a new area. Quite creepy. The atmosphere is pretty good. I'll give it that. That's kind of a weird door. No electricity. I need to find a foos. Where can we find a foos? <laughs> I still can't interact with it. Ah, oh, Jesus. Anyway. 
I'm gonna go this way. See if there's anything. Anything in these drawers? No. Anything here? Well, a couple of bottles of wine. And a beaker. That's great. Oh. Key needs a door. Ah. I guess we're gonna go this way now. I guess. Okay then. I'm going this way. Creepy noises. Jesus. Jesus H. Who opened that? That is so weird. Anyway, moving on. What's this? Creepy picture, number one. Creepy picture, number two. And creepy picture, number three. Yay. And then there's another restroom. With a key. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Let me grab this key here. Thank you. You suck. <laughs> uh, Elmer Fudd laugh. Well, I guess I'm going back. <laughs> okay, I'm done. As annoying as to you guys. Going this way. I need a fuse for it. So I'm gonna find a locked door. Wait, wasn't there one in the kitchen? Let me go, let me run there. I think there's one. Yeah! This door. And it looks like we got another note to read. Oh boy. I have an awful day. One of the girls in the room woke up screamingly. We had rough time rough time calming her, then asked her what happened. She told that she woke up feeling a heavy weight on her, and it was her grandmother who who was who was died three years ago, looking at her face stubborn stubbornly. The girl told her grandmother to stand up, but she left off. It was that moment. Fulia woke up mid-sleep mid and woke Alisai to, for that she saw. Alisai fluttering in her bed. Alisai still hasn't regained her consciousness. For a week, that kind of strange things occur. We heard that there is a ritual in front of the bathroom. There were strange, odd, cursive letters and shapes. And I don't know whether someone's kidding us or they have summoned some kind of demon. The director is slurring over, saying someone must have pranked you. Thanks for the note. Thanks, buddy. Uh, oh, look, a fuse. Thank you. I don't believe that door opens. I'm going to try it anyway. Yeah, I can inter interact with it. Anywho... Get this fuse. Put the fools in the door. Oh, shit. What door was it? Oh, not this way. This way. Yeah, here we go. Insert fuse. Okay. Okay, now. That's obviously blocked off by a frickin' ladder. I can just move it out of the way and be done. Here, can I try it? Of course I can't. Screw you, game. God, this main character is useless. Uh. Okay, moving on. To this door. Ooh, loading screen. This looks great. So we're on to the 
Next reoccurring level. Door's locked. Ah, keypad. I don't know the code to this one. Alright. Wait. I can interact with that and find a key. But I can't interact with the ladder. Whatever. Okay. Which door is it? Is the question. I want to see what's in the other door. I'm thinking this might be the key for it. I can't interact with that one, so I'm going to rush through it. I just don't care anymore. I just don't give a shit. I don't give a best at home shit. Okay. So now, we're in the next section. Oh, this thing. That was actually from uh, the first Saw game, if I remember correctly. Anyway. We got a wheelchair. I hear crying. Oh boy. Okay, you can stop now. Okay. Bizarre things started to happen in midnight. We can't even go to bath go to the bathroom. The doors are getting locked. House furniture and stuff are moving. We began to blame each other each other about those the director is the offender one they say why him though why would he do this kind of excuse me kind of nonsense some people have left the dorm if things continue to happen like this i will have to leave too then stops right there okay uh, is there anything in here? Not these boxes. It looks, it feels like, it feels like there's a strangeness on this pic, on this painting. Oh, hello. I collected something weird. Hi, Teddy Bear. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, my God, this is creepy. I can't go through the steam pipe. Apparently. Oh, guess what? I have the key for it. Yeah. Oh, the code is 4000. So, good to know. So I can get through that one door. Thanks, no. So uh, I want to check if there's something else. And... Hi. Hello. Okay then. Let me read this note here. I saw him. He he hid something behind the painting. I just figured that out <laughs> like a couple minutes ago. Thanks for telling me. And that's a bear with a heart. I heart you. So the code is 4000. 4000. So I'm going to input that code right now. Okay. Four zero zero. Oh. Four zero zero zero. Enter. All right. That's the same creepy wedding picture from the last game. And there's two stone heads. They were there too. Ugh. Anyway. More to read. 
I, I learned that the director abused a few of those girls. Then the girls have summoned and infested demons on him for revenge. I don't know if it's true, but the director was not acting right, though he had rarely come to the dorm since the beginning of the events. I called my mother and asked her to, to terminate my pledge with the dorm and pick up, pick me up off here. But my mother told me that I called her second time today. You told that you're happy and comfortable there and there and that you won't come back home for a long while. She said, what the hell? I haven't called my mother before today. I am frightened. I have to leave as soon as possible. Okay. Creepy. Yeah, you should leave. I'm a goddamn. Can I open the doors? Horses. Oh. How does these work? Oh, do they have to be facing each other? That's my guess. Oh! I actually got it correctly. Where is it then? Where's the key? You horses know where the keys are? Hello? Senor? I can't find... Oh! Secret bookshelf. What a coincidence. Oh! Key. Key picked up. Nicely. Cool. So now... I'd like to figure out where this key goes. Through here? I can't interact with that one. God, where's the key? Does it go down here? My guess is good as yours. Let's see, where does the key go to? Not that way. Oh, that's the steam pipe. Wait a minute. I've already searched there. Where, where am I supposed to go next? Is the question. So it's not that door. Is it through this door? Ah, here we go. Oh, switch. Gas panel. Oh, okay, nice. And there's nothing in that I can interact. I can't interact with that. Cool, I turned off the steam. So, uh, let's go down. This way. Or was it? Oh, never mind, let's just go this way. That's where the steam pipe goes. Oh, God! Oh, God! Run! Run! Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Fuck you, bitch. 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 Aha! Take that! And I will end it here. Wow. I guess it's a little bit more creepier than the first one. So, uh, I'll leave an end of the note here. So, hopefully this new screen recorder works out for you guys. And it's working really well. So, I hope you best sound friends enjoy. Subscribe to me if you haven't. Click the bell to get notified of my next video. And comment and like about this. And share the video, most importantly. And I will see you best sound friends on my next video. Seizure. Later.